Hey friends, welcome to another episode of Unboxing the Books with Miss Jen and Miss Kristen at the Nanuet Library. Let's get started. Let's see what we have today. Let's start off. I'm going to move these so that you can see my face. Okay. Ooh, Battle Royale, Lethal Warriors, Witches vs. Genies, and Medusa vs. Hell. Hell? I guess. Interesting. You guys, who's going to win? Come and check these out and find out. Next up, I love this series, Little People, Big Dreams. So, so good. This one is about Dolly Parton. Huh. What an amazing woman. So definitely come and check this out. I love the colors. I love the illustrations. I love the story. I love Dolly. So definitely come and get this one. It's a great series for those of you who are not ready for a Who Was book yet or any of the DK books. Um, and it's a great little mini biography. Um, just a really great series. Next up, Miss Aretha Franklin, the Queen of Soul Respect. Carol Boston Weatherford, Weatherford, I mean, just such an incredible author. All of her books are incredible and amazing, and she just is really able to tell the story of whoever she's writing about in such an, an, a beautiful way. Um, and then the illustrations by Frank Morrison, the art by Frank Morrison, just gorgeous. Definitely come and check this out. This would be a great book to keep and to have and to showcase. Next up, chapter books. Let's see what we have. Huh, Once Upon a Unicorn by Lou Anders. Have you ever heard of a unicorn who is more interested in science experiments than magic? Or a flaming horse who's a walking fire hazard? Or with a pumpkin headed terror known as Jack O the Hunt on the loose? The monsters untold threatening their home. This unlikely pair must team up to save all of Whisperwood and themselves. So this is definitely a, um, oh, it looks like there's four in the series so far. Oh no, I totally lied. Um, that's a different series by him, but this looks like it's going to also become a series. So Once Upon a Unicorn. Then we have The Mistwick School of Music Craft by Jessica Corey. This also has to do with spells and witchcraft. Love that. This title breaks my heart. It's the Teddy Saga, They Threw Us Away by Daniel Kraus. I mean, your teddy bear is thrown away. So this is going to actually, like it says, be um, a saga. So I'm thinking it's a trilogy. Um, so Buddy wakes up in the middle of a garbage dump and he's a teddy bear and he spent time at a store waiting for his future to begin to be bought and loved by a child. But he finds that something's wrong and so... Other discarded teddies, Horace, Sugar, Sunny, and Reginald, now they have to figure out what's going on. So they go on this perilous journey um, to find out what's going on. Um, it looks beautiful, sad. Get your tissues, I'm sure. Um, and, and what I love about this is that there's also illustrations inside. I really do love when novels, young novels, have um, the illustrations as well. It really just adds to the story. So come and check that out. And then we have Survivor Girl by Erin Teagan, and she's the author of the American Girl Luciana books. So there's that. And picture books. Cool Cuts, written and illustrated by Mikal Renee Rowe, author of Happy Hair. Love it. Bright Kid, Fun Style, Cool Cuts. And then Happy Hair for girls down here. Hmm. Vinny gets a job, written, written and illustrated by Terry Brodner. Look at this little dog going to work. Hey, I don't know. Let's see, I think Vinny's gonna get himself into a lot of trouble. Every night is pizza night. Who doesn't love pizza? If you don't, I don't know what to tell you. Written by J. Kenji Lopez, all illustrated by Gianna Ruggiero. I love pizza. So many different ways you can make it. In fact, I'm actually doing Crafternoon in December for English muffin pizzas. So um, 
This is really cute because this little girl thinks that pizza is the best and she goes around her neighborhood and she finds that the best might not mean what she thought it meant. So she's going to meet new people and she's going to meet new foods. And it's going to be a really great cultural and um, nationality journey that she goes on. So that's important for us all to learn about other people's cultures and their foods and um, their customs. So every night is pizza night. Definitely come and get that as well. That's it for this week. We still have loads of new books behind us and more coming in every day. So we will see you next week for another unboxing of the books. Stay safe, friends. Bye-bye.